Looks like about 3.55 left in this first half. 12 players. 12, Momus is saying 12 players left on each side. So, Ryan, I think you're right. I think it's going to be tough for either team to uh, take a point here before halftime. Yeah, the game is just too slow nowadays. Uh, six minutes is not enough time. Was it, do you feel like it was faster when you played? We've talked about this in some of the other broadcasts. It has definitely changed since I played. Um, I don't think we see as much of the pyramid in the back corners anymore. Yeah. And that started really picking up when I was playing. But my Kent State team, all we did was play fast because we had no structure. Yeah. That's my teams were very unstructured. It was just like run and gun, offense 100, defense 0. Six left in the half, score five. Plenty of players on the outside. Yeah. Just kind of exchanging volleys right now. Neither team really making progress. It's stymieing the other's efforts. And I decide who really wants to be the one to open this game up. Will Shire, number 16, going out there for MSU. And James Paul Tandy for Kent was just out on the other end. I saw that. It's a little one-for-one one swap there. I think that gives us 11-on-11 11 11 now. Team catch. Brings back in number 96 for Michigan State. This may be the most communicative Spartan team I have seen ever. Just without thinking, all of them immediately called out the uh, pop-up ball. Everyone looked up brief enough to see what was going on. And the, the player who was uh, in the intended trajectory just immediately stuck out and stuck it out. Wouldn't you know it, kept the player alive. And it's those kind of veteran, savvy veteran moves that differentiate the really good teams, the elite teams, from the next tier of teams. Fair statement. Who did Michigan State play in the first round? Um, Towson. They played Towson in the first round. Do we know the score of that game? Or? Three to one. Three to one victory for Michigan State. Yeah, the last point coming garbage time. Yeah. What did, uh, what did the final score end up being for um, Kent State versus Central Michigan? 2-0. Two 2-0, nothing, two nothing. wow. So Which I think was surprised a lot of people. Kent really held their own. Yeah. Only got 45 seconds left in the half. Yeah, 40 seconds. It seems like this point's probably going to go to halftime. Twenty seconds left in this first half. Kent State nursing a huge ball advantage here as we wrap up this first half. Massimino gets hit there in the back. And that will do it for the first half. We'll go into halftime. Tied 1-1. We'll be back with the second half here shortly.